Is in the studio now, and Tish, two women want to know whether they were secretly recorded. Now. And let's start by getting everyone caught up on the timeline. Action News Jacks first reported in June of last year that Dr. Manpreet Grewal resigned after he was accused of secretly recording people in the bathroom at his office. Six months later, we told you, the state attorney's office decided to decided not to criminally charge Grewal, saying it had insufficient evidence. Now two women are suing the doctor and his former employer, North Florida, both worried they were recorded in the bathroom. I cried uh, so much at first, but then it turned to rage. Julie Cruz's medical records show Dr. Manpreet Grewa examined her inside this building at St. Vincent South Point in June 2017. She says Grewa insisted on examining her in the staff bathroom. I told my husband, I'm not comfortable with going in that bathroom. And he's like, well, he He's the doctor, you know, you trust the doctor. It's the same bathroom where Greenwall was accused of recording people on the toilet less than a year later. A JSO report says both a doctor who found an iPhone concealed in a staff bathroom and the office manager told police Greenwall admitted that it was his phone and stated he had made a great mistake. The report says a doctor told police Greenwall said he destroyed his phone. North Florida surgeons did not call JSO, instead hiring a private investigator. JSO was not notified until a woman who worked there reported it. And then when I saw your story on the news, I just screamed. Cruz and another patient, Amy Horton, who used that bathroom during multiple appointments, says in their lawsuit, they're worried they were secretly recorded. They're suing Grewa and North Florida surgeons for what's called discovery. They want evidence and information as a precursor to a malpractice or invasion of privacy lawsuit. I just knew I had to you know, do something about it, I feel an obligation to other women and other people. Action News Jack's investigator Jenna Bourne called Dr. Manpreet Grewal twice. I'd like to give you the chance to tell us your side of the story on this. She also emailed an attorney who's represented him before three times, but she hasn't gotten a response. Well, Action News Jax reached out to North Florida Surgeon's attorney three times about this story over the past two weeks. He has not responded.